Our prepared speech of the day is Miss Juan Lin. She has been a casual Toastmaster for years. <laughs> she continues to strive to be more than a casual Toastmaster, one speech or role at a time. Today, Juan will be giving her seventh ACM speech from the Advanced Communicator Manual Entertaining Speaker. And the title of her five to seven minute speech is, If You Want to Stay Cool. Please join me in welcoming Hua. <laughs> OMG, girl! Did you see Beyonce? She was slaying. Her OOTD was on fleek. Oh my god. Please, fam, you're so 2015. She was snatched. Did anybody understand what was said? Anybody? No. That's how I feel if I hear all these conversations on social media. I mean, back in the days, we had words like totally, awesome, no, duh. What about take a chill pill? Don't have a cow. Radical. <laughs> But now, every generation seems to come up with new slang words, new acronyms that they're using on social media. I feel old. I don't know. I can't keep up with all these new terms. So I hope this lesson is illuminating for everyone. If you want to stay cool, know the lingo. So let's break it down and go back to the conversation I just demonstrated. <laughs> The breakdown. OMG, who knows what OMG is? That was the easy one, right? Yes. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> Did you see what Queen Bee was wearing? She was slaying. Who knows what slaying means? It means <laughs> awesome, amazing. She's great. Yeah, she was killing me. What is yeah. OOTD? Outfit of the, the day. day. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Outfit of the day photos. <laughs> on fleek. On point. On point. Mm -hmm. However, that's so 2015, you guys. It's snatched now, okay? So don't get stuck in 2015. We're in 2016 oh now, okay? And fam, that's not her name. It's in reference to family. They shortened it to fam, and it's referencing just a single person. It's kind of like a endearment, term of endearment. Now back in the days, we would have, if we heard that conversation, it wouldn't be like that. It would probably be something like, dude, did you see Beyonce? She rocked it. Her duds were totally the bee's knees. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> sorry. That's prob I probably mixed up a lot of different decades <laughs> in one sentence, yeah, right? <laughs> Demonstrating that every decade, every year, it seems <coughs> new things. I haven't even gotten to the acronyms. But before we get to the acronyms, what are the popular terms today? Snatched <laughs> is the new fleek, okay? Don't be using fleek anymore. Slain, we already went through that. Fam, squad, if you're referring to more than one person. Ship, ship, short for relationship. Except for, it's used as a verb. For instance, I ship Ryan Gosling and Rachel McAdams. They're totally OTP. Anybody know what OTP means? Uh, one true <laughs> pairing. I really like them together. I wish they get back. But that's <laughs> the point. You would use that as a verb. How do we keep up with this? Net Netflix and chill. <laughs> My husband actually texted me that as a joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, cool, yeah. Let's have a movie date night. What do we want to watch? Yeah, I didn't mean that. <laughs> it means hooking up. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Bay, what is bay? Short Ooh. for baby, right? Mm -hmm. But it's also an acronym for before anyone else. Oh. Because oh. baby isn't short enough. So they got to shorten it one extra syllable. <laughs> Lit. Like illumination, right? Mm -hmm. Amazing! You're great. Another acronym for great. Woke. Anybody know woke? Yeah. Are you guys who's voting for Trump in here? 
No. Well, everybody woke. That's yes. Everyone's woke. Yeah. Basically means oh, keeping current on yeah, current be, events yeah, and cultural woke, issues. Be so you better be woke. Mm -hmm. be woke. Yeah. <laughs> basic. Yeah, we use that one. Basic is pretty. Yeah. Basic. Yeah, basic. Yeah, we're basic. I'm, I'm, I admit I'm basic, I'm original, mainstream. At, at Baskin Robbins, 31 flavors, I would choose vanilla. Mm -hmm. Pretty basic. <laughs> we should probably put twerk on there for a <laughs> okay, let's do a quiz on acronyms. D Y K. Do you know? Do you know? <laughs> Did you know? What is this? I don't know. know. I don't know. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. These are easy. Oh, you only live oh. once. You only live once. Lots of love. love. No. no. <laughs> 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 Laughing out loud. <laughs> OMG, we covered that. By the way, mm -hmm. PM. I actually, private message. Private message. Oh. I absolutely wrote DM, that on PM, our you know, goes there. Cool. Someone. Right. And they're like, what is right. PM? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> SMH, I actually looked this yeah. up on Google. I'm shaking my head. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> IKR. I know, right? <laughs> I know. <laughs> IMO and IMHO. In my office. In my opinion. In my opinion. In my honest opinion. TBH. To be honest. To be honest. NDD. No big deal. No big deal. Oh my gosh. KK. Cool. Okay. Cool. Or okay. okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. 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 These terms right here are, I've come across them myself in my Facebook groups and specialized, there's specialized groups like the mom groups, mm -hmm. darling husband, darling son, darling daughter, little one. Oh, wow. And BST. Buy, sell, trade, make me an offer, excellent use condition, for sale, for trade, for sale, or trade. That's like business. So if you're in like those yard sale groups on Facebook, they would use terms like that. IRL. In real life. In real life. <laughs> PAP. Post a pic. Or else it's not Facebook official. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Now, every day, every day, oh, even yeah. has an acronym. Anybody know Monday? Man Crush Monday. Monday. <laughs> Tuesday? Oh, Taco Tuesday. Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. Oh, there's a lot of different ones. Also, I've heard one Turn one. Back Tuesday. Oh. Yeah. That was Wednesday, 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 Throwback Thursday, Throwback yeah, Thursday, 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 Flashback Friday, Friday. Friday. Yeah. Saturday? Uh, yeah. Not too Friday. common. Too, <laughs> too busy out and about already. There's you know, no time to document it. Sabbath, Saturday. <laughs> Maybe back a couple decades. Sunday, selfie, oh, Sunday. Oh, wow. That's terrible. Sunday, Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. So, We've covered some of the common terms, some of the acronyms used today. If you want to stay cool or cool, whatever the term may be at the moment, stay illuminated. Don't be, don't stay ignorant. For the, for example, this mom was text, texting their son, our daughter. What are these mean? And she says it, but. She didn't know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> and this mom texts this daughter, you know, be careful on the road, YOLO. <laughs> Not exactly the <laughs> advice that you want to give in that situation. <laughs> Basically tell her go ahead and speed the icy roads. <laughs> and this one, this, this next one is for Mary Jane. <laughs> Your great aunt just passed away, LOL. What's so funny? What do you mean? Mom, that means laughing out loud. I thought it meant lots of love. <laughs> and she ended up texting that to all the family members. Wow. Wow. So, if you want to stay current, stay hip, stay cool. Stay what? Stay illuminated. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah. Who is woke after that? Thank you. I am not cool. <laughs> I don't think anyone got 100%. Maybe 80%.